Hello, Nate here at Viking Mesic US headquarters in Wisconsin. Today I'm going to show you how to use the bag loading magazine. The bag loading magazine was created by our research and development department. It simplifies the bag loading and facilitates higher machine efficiencies during the bag loading process. The bag loading magazine assembly can be added to any full size Viking pre made pouch machine in our lineup and is a standard design feature on our new Viking pre-made compact machine. Its setup and use is quick and easy, but before we get into it, take a moment to hit pause and read our safety notice. Only qualified individuals should operate the machine. Please don't hurt yourself or somebody else. With that said, let's load some bags. The bag loading magazine holds and stages the bags for placement onto the infeed conveyor. It uses a series of adjustable guides and retainers to hold the bag in place. A set of suction cups then move up to grab the bottom bag out of the magazine and place it onto the infeed conveyor. Follow these steps to set up the magazine for running a new bag. Step 1. Use the width adjustment crank to adjust the magazine to accommodate the width of the bag. To ensure that the bags do not hang up in the magazine, adjust the magazine just slightly larger than your bag width. Once you find the perfect position, take note of the position for future use by copying the width displayed on the crank's dial. Step 2. Use the length adjustment crank to adjust the magazine to accommodate the length of the bag. When making the adjustment for bag length, the crank also automatically moves the rear suction cup to the needed distance for the bag. To ensure that the bags will not hang up in the magazine, adjust the length of the magazine so it is slightly longer than your bag length. After finding the perfect position, Take note of the position for future use by copying the width displayed on the crank's dial. Step 3. As needed, adjust the bag retainers. Adjust the retainers in far enough so the bags do not fall through the magazine when it is full, but adjust them out far enough so the suction cups can easily pull a bag out of the magazine. Finding the best spot for the bag retainers may take a little trial and error dependent on your bag's properties. Step 4. After your adjustments are complete, load the bags with the open end of the bag facing the machine. Note: Perform all other size change procedures for your machine type before running the machine. Step 5. Turn on bag loading and run the machine. That's it for setting up the bag magazine. Be sure to check out our lineup of pre-made pouch machines in action at vikingmasic.com. Also be sure to hit that like and subscribe below. As always, till next time, enjoy life and happy packaging.